And gigs like this just remind me how bad of an actress I am. The actual behind the scenes look of being a content creator. found my new filming angle when I'm at my desk. Um, so today we're going to be doing a day in my life as a content creator. It is just one of those days where the sun is shining in my room, the windows are open, and I'm just feeling creative. I'm going to start out by just checking my email, seeing what I've missed overnight. I have a meeting at 9 a.m. so I'm going to get prepared for that meeting on the topics we're going to discuss and then after the meeting I'm going to get ready a little bit more because I have some filming I need to do for a couple projects so it is just going to be a great day. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so I got my meeting notes already in check. Um, we're going to go through content ideas, and this is going to be our first, like, analytical check to see what's going on on her Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, all the places. So I have some things I got to address to her about that. And then I just joined a Zoom meeting. I wanted to see what I looked like to see if I needed to, like do my hair or anything but this looks pretty casual so we're all good and ready for our hour long meeting hey this is a newer client and i'm doing like full-on social media management going into like the whole freelancing world that's what i wanted to do with social media management so and it quickly turned over to like video editing and some management but a lot of like content creation so it's so cool that i now have a client that i do like full-on management for share advice teach her how to like navigate all of the apps because we're working on so many apps like we have youtube instagram TikTok, Facebook, like it's just so insane. Now that I'm done with that call, I kind of feel like awake and ready to get stuff done. I was looking at my dashboard for this one project and I think the script is actually ready. I am actually gonna get ready and film this. I, it's due in two days, but I'm just gonna knock it out today. And I think the rest of the day I'm going to plan some content as well as edit my video to go up tomorrow because it's Friday, Friday uploads. So welcome to a day in my life. Just a lot of back and forth, spontaneous stuff. I also have a fan going on. So if you hear that in the background, I'm sorry, I have a windsock on, but okay. Now I'm gonna go eat and get ready for my day. I'll update you guys once I'm done with that. had some lunch and now I'm posting my client content so I just got my clients TikTok up and I'm gonna cross post it on Instagram Facebook and then after that I'm going to go ahead and get to filming I'm gonna change my shirt and then probably change back because I love my outfit that I'm wearing today it's like this sweatshirt and then the shorts like the same color as this and then I'm just gonna be editing all afternoon I already have my coffee as well which is amazing. I'm so interested to see like what I look like when I'm working because I've seen some past footage and it's like I look so focused. By the way, I've never really been super familiar with Facebook before. Um, so this is like a whole new ball game for me. And it's so complicated, honestly. But you know what? I'm navigating my way through it. I honestly am thinking about like taking a course at this point just learning the whole in and out of Facebook and like the back end. But after this meeting, I definitely have some more responsibilities to take over. So I feel like every week for like the next month or so, it's just me learning to like adapt to new tasks and 
getting myself into a rhythm. But that's one thing I really like about this kind of job is that you're always doing something new. You're always like busy doing something and that I just, I love that. And I officially just posted my very first Facebook reel. It's amazing. And now on for Instagram. <sighs> I better go ahead and start filming for this gig because I am starting to get tired. <laughs> a little bit about this specific project is this is for a ad agency that specializes in like digital apps and games and just basically in like the app world and they recently hired on UGC creators to be like actors um, to play out some of the ads. So one of the projects I did was for like this car racing uh, gaming app actually the same app is looking for another ad and it's like a pvp like racing competition so i'm gonna be filming my portion i have a script that i'm gonna read out loud and like reenact me playing a game essentially and kind of being in competition with another person and then send it in for approval if they need any revisions that's awesome Cool thing is, is that there's two of these kind of projects for like the same app. So I think I'm only filming one of them today. I'm person A, please make sure that the background is clean, no objects in the way. Also make it seem like you're holding a phone. If a phone does show, make sure you're holding it horizontally. Ooh, so in the ad, I'm driving a Porsche. That's really cool. So I gotta remember my lines because I'm an actress today. This is gonna take a few takes. I know that for sure. Here's my current point of view. Um, I have my utensil holder that I did with my last gig for another UGC project. So reusing that. My container for Q-tips. And then my camera. I also have uh, the script right here. Hopefully my acting skills will be on par today, but this is the setup. I thought the headphones would be like a nice touch because, you know, it's a gaming. Also, my camera just fell asleep on me. All right, I'm gonna get to filming and I'll come back with an update. I'm not gonna lie, that probably took like an hour to film. And gigs like this just remind me how bad of an actress I am. So hopefully this is good. Worst case scenario, I have to refilm, which is fine. I know my lines very well now, um, but literally a little life hack, know what kind of app you're gonna be like creating content for. I downloaded the app that this ad is for and I like played in real time. So I got like my actual reaction um, on like losing and winning and stuff. So I think it made the reactions more authentic. And then I just had to practice my lines of like when I win and when I lose, so. Okay, so today we are on day three of the hair burst posting on a hair burst video is officially done i need to like really edit this video now it's like 6 30 it needs to go up in like 12 13 14 15 hours and i'm going to be sleeping for the majority of those hours so um let's get cracking on editing dinner should be ready soon so i'm gonna take a little bit of a break to eat and go for my walk and stuff still gotta get some movement in um but yeah today was a lot of sitting i feel like this is like a good video to show like the actual behind the scenes look of being a content creator it's not always like taking photos and videos and looking pretty all the time it's a lot of back-end work with emails and calls and um spontaneous content creating days so that's kind of where we're at right now but i'm gonna get to editing <laughs> Thank you. 